You know how I love to geek out on HVAC talk. I got a brand new ERV from Panasonic called their IntelliBalance 100. We're gonna do a review today. We're talking fresh air today and specifically a brand new model ERV from Panasonic that I really like that solves a bunch of problems for builders trying to meet the fresh air standards with ASHRAE 62.2. So let's get right into it. This is their IntelliBalance 100, brand new to the marketplace. It's a 100 CFM ERV, but it's got a couple of features that are super unique. Number one, it can vary its capacity. We can change this unit right up top here and change it from 50 CFM of supply up to 100 CFM in 10 CFM increments. And because it's got dual motors on here, we can change both the supply air and the exhaust air differentially. I like that because now I can decide do I want to positively pressurize, negatively pressurize, or balance that air in my house. Very nice. The other thing that it's got on here is this timer system. This is gonna help you meet that code by varying the amount of time this fan is gonna run over the course of an hour. We can click this right here and it can go from 10 minutes per hour anywhere up to 60 minutes an hour in 10 minute increments. A lot of adjustability. With these DC motors also brings a lot of efficiency. When this thing's running full tilt at 100 CFM, it's only pulling down 83 watts. Very impressive. And with their smart flow technology, these DC motors can sense, hey, I've got a restriction in my pipe. I need to actually ramp up my motor speed to get to the CFM that it says I'm delivering. Very impressive unit. Of course, here's the heart of the system though. This is the enthalpy core. This is an ERV or energy recovery ventilator. When we bring that fresh air in, especially in our hot, humid climate zones, sometime we're, sometimes we're bringing in very humid air and we wanna exchange that humidity from the inside stream to the outside stream so that that air coming in has less humidity in it. The beauty of this ERV is that it also functions as HRV duties as well. It's gonna move the heat as well as the moisture. So really this unit could be installed in Texas, in North Carolina, or in North Dakota. Very impressive that I could use this anywhere and adjust it both in capacity and in um, enthalpy versus heat recovery to whatever zone I'm looking for. Here's one thing that really separates this unit though from others that I've seen and I was really excited when I saw this. This has a very nice filtration system. Comes standard with a Mervate filter right here. Super easy to get to. We can clean that out with a vacuum every 90 days or we can replace it and we can actually upgrade to MERV 13 filtration. That's unheard of in an ERV. Very impressive. Okay, the last thing I wanna mention on this is install. There's a couple different methods to install this. We can do this as a standalone unit where we have a couple of uh, vents in the house that it's gonna to supply to, or we could dump it into our HVAC system. And speaking of uh, vents, check this out. This is also brand new from Panasonic in 2017. This is their recessed inlet. This has the ability to suck air out of, let's say, a bathroom, but do it in an inconspicuous way. This has an LED bulb, so a very efficient bulb in here. It's gonna look like a standard ceiling trim, but in fact, this is a vent, or it could be a supply. We take this damper out, and now we could supply air through here. Or if we wanted to match this so it looked the same in other parts, we can actually take this off, block it off, and now it's just a recessed light in that bathroom. Very impressive new products from Panasonic. Hey, if you want more information on anything we talked about today, check that link below. You're gonna to get to a Panasonic website that's gonna give you more here. But overall, very impressive new unit from Panasonic that's gonna solve a lot of problems for builders throughout the US, and they make a cold climate version on this. So if you're watching this in Canada, they make a version just for you. Hey, thanks for joining us today in the Build Show. I'd love to have you follow me on Twitter or Instagram. Otherwise, we'll see you next time for more geeky HVAC talk.